What's up everybody? Welcome to door number 8 of the advance calendar. For this video today I thought a little bit what I can do and I came to the conclusion that I want to show you how I make my videos. So with no further to do, let's get started. I have two camera I have two cameras that I'm using for the video productions. The first one is the Zoom Q8. And the, th and the second camera that I'm using is the iPhone 5. The next thing that I want to talk about is the camera positions. And we see right off the bat that I'm using two tripods. The first one stands in the way like that the camera position faces the drum set in this way. So it captures everything that my drum set has, all instruments in this direction and I think this camera position is good. And then I have the second tripod which stands here on this platform on this board and uh, I'm using this camera position, so like that. This is the camera position that I always use and I think it's great. It captures the drum set in front. It sees everything that's in front of my drum set and I love this camera position thing that I want to talk about is the video cutting. So I'm using Shotcut. Shotcut is a very good free uh, video cutting program that I'm using all the time because I don't have the money for the professional cutting programs. So I'm using shortcut all the time and I really like it for being a very free um, cutting program and it has a wide array of great functions and uh, I think for a free program this is good enough. Naturally I can't do anything with this program that professionals can do with the programs but in my possibilities I think this program here is great enough. So the video thumbnails that I make are based on some pictures and the camera that I use for making the pictures is this. So I'm using my iPhone 5 as the camera for the thumbnails. So I do thumbnails with the iPhone 5 and uh, yeah, as, as I have told you before, I use it also for video baking, but mostly now I'm using it for making the thumbnails because the camera from this iPhone 5 is okay for making thumbnails and I'm showing you right now and this is the last part of the video the programs that I'm using for making the thumbnails. So if this. So if the thumbnails need to be very simple, 
I make them with the Windows Paint and I'm using it a lot because when I make simple um, thumbnails it is okay because I don't have Photoshop I don't have any other professional uh, photo making or editing program so I'm using paint for simple thumbnails but if this but if the thumbnails need to be more complex I'm using GIMP because GIMP is a great free alternative to uh, Photoshop and other photo editing programs and I'm using it a lot as well. So I'm using GIMP or Windows Paint depending what I want and how I want it. All right, that's it for today. Thanks for watching, thanks for subscribing and uh, I hope you liked this video and when you like this video please give me a like, subscribe, etc. and uh, thanks for watching and we'll see us in the next video and that will be tomorrow and bye bye.